All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how I clean any leather surfaces that I have, like wallets, handbags, and things like that. So the first thing you wanna do is take a cotton round dipped in rubbing alcohol and just give your whole bag or wallet a nice wipe down. This will take out all the bacteria and everything from the pores, and because it is leather, it does have pores because it is skin. So you want to make sure that the bacteria and everything comes out. You don't want to use water because it doesn't have a disinfectant property like alcohol does. Make sure you wipe the inside of your wallet too. I'm just skipping that part in this video because I don't want to make it too long. Don't forget wiping down any metal surfaces or zippers or rhinestones or anything like that too. And once you've done that, we can move on to step number two. Mix one teaspoon of detergent with a quarter cup of warm water. As you can see, there's a coffee stain on my wallet, so I'm going to use a cotton round and the mixture that I made just now and try to wipe it off. Doing this should get rid of most surface stains. After this, if you still feel like your wallet or bag needs to be cleaned a little more, then you can move on to the next step, which is to use shaving cream. I'm just going to be using a little bit of shaving cream because as you can see, it starts to lather and it starts to spread really quickly, so a little goes a long way. I'm going to start spreading it all over and I'm going to start rubbing it in just to lather it up. Once it's all lathered in, just let it sit for a minute or two. Once you let this sit for a while, use a bounce sheet to scrub the leather. I like using a bounce sheet to scrub the leather because it's not as aggressive as a sponge or scrubber would be on the leather. It might leave marks if you use a sponge, so I prefer to just use this fabric softener. When you're done scrubbing, use a dampened paper towel or washcloth to just wipe away all the shaving cream. After that, wipe the moisture away with a dry paper towel or washcloth. For ink stains, try to take it out as soon as you see it because you don't want it to sit there and sink into the pores. It gets harder to take out later. For tougher stains like pen marks or anything, you might want to try hairspray because that's the most aggressive product that you can use on leather at home. But if it doesn't work, then you might have to go to a dry cleaner and have them take it out because there really isn't much you can do about it. I hope this video was helpful and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe.